This is Coda Territory Sports, sponsored by the Box Event Center. Good evening, everybody. The girls' state tennis tournaments are going to be played next week in Rapid City. The Class A tourney is on Monday and Tuesday. St. Thomas Moore is focused on taking home the team championship. Here's a closer look at the Cavaliers. The St. Thomas Moore girls tennis team is amongst the best in the state this season and a strong focus on fundamentals is the key to the Cavaliers success. Always in tennis, the fundamentals, the ball toss, the moving your feet, the getting the racket back, getting in a position to hit the ball, following through. I just can go on and on with the, how important the fundamentals are and we're constantly working at that. What I really appreciate about the girls is they're so coachable. Uh, they listen to what we tell them, they follow through. Coach Grant has some nice depth on this year's team and the players have a strong bond on and off the court. They encourage each other, we practice well, we interact well. Uh, that, that chemistry is huge uh, and really carries uh, onto the court. You know, beyond that, the, the players lift each other up, encourage each other, don't let each other get down when, uh, when things get tough. And those, the mental part of this game is so huge. Those two aspects are significant. STM is led by defending Flight One state champion Athena Francelisso, and she is once again one of the best in the state. Athena's the anchor on our team. She's just solid, dependable. Every time she steps out on the court, we know we're going to get 100% from her. And the other girls follow suit. You know, they, 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 they follow her lead, and she's demonstrated that leadership. Sharia has demonstrated leadership. Amity, our one, two, and three players, have all demonstrated leadership. The Class A Girls State Tennis Tournament will be played next Monday and Tuesday in Rapid City. And the Cavs should be in the mix for the team championship. I think we're in a good position to not only compete well at state, but possibly possibly take first place. I mean, we know there's at least one other really tough team we're going to come up against uh, and some tough players along the way. But, you know, I believe in, uh, in our team, believe in our girls. I think we have a good chance to do very, very well uh, at the state tournament. Should be fun to watch the Cavs next Monday and Tuesday at the State Tennis Tourney. We have some high school football coaching news to tell you about this evening as Stevens has parted ways with head coach Patrick Town. Now, Town was in his first season at the helm of the Raiders. Now Stevens has dropped its first five games of the season. Joe Moore will take over as the interim head coach for the remainder of the season. He was an assistant. The Raiders will play at Sioux Falls Jefferson coming up tomorrow night.